Again, it's a bowler. Winning a good header. Lee Bullen, Gally Mason. Had to hurry with the pass. Dykhausen got himself on the end of it. Back from Thompson. Nicholson to Petrie. Now it's Dare. Miss hit from Dasevich. Here's a chance for Dykhausen. And it must be for Scott Thompson. St. Johnston had chances to get that away. He couldn't take them. And Dunfermline now have some hope. After this goal from Thompson. There was the miss hit from Dasevich. The header was won by Thompson. Dykhausen's effort blocked by Alan Main. And the goal was empty for Thompson there to steer the ball in his third goal of the season and it's 2-1 16 minutes into the second half Parker beaten by Todd Alan Dodds with a header away Forward from Nicholson. One well by Bullen for Thompson. And now Jason Deere and Dykhausen! It's 2-2! Two -two. His second goal for Dunfermline. His first game was a sub against Dundee United at the weekend. And that could be a big goal from a big guy. Dykhausen climbing to meet Jason Deere's cross and it was virtually an empty net for the Dutchman and from 2-0 down then Berman claw their way back to 2 all, and we've got 12 minutes remaining solid stop Rossi finds Thompson David Moss tucked in behind him Jason Deere incessant attacking from Dunfermline here's the substitute Rob Matai off the chest of Weir didn't get it controlled back to Deere and what an effort that was and David Moss makes it 3-2 the recovery is complete an incredible second half fight back by Dunfermline and that's a broad smile from Moss after Jim Weir's mistake. The shots back off the uprights and the first there was David Moss. It was Thompson's effort which beat Maine, came back off the post and before anyone could even think about a reaction, David Moss had buried the ball in the back of the net. Seven minutes left, 3-2 Dunfermline.